Science is fascinating. Even when you uncover just a small uh, new discovery, it's very exciting. It means you're the first person to know something more about GPCRs than anybody else. And that's really infectious. It just makes you want to keep going and going. And uh, I just wanted to add a question about uh, PCM21. It was an amazing experience for me. It really gives us exposure to amazing scientists like him and also this kind of stimulating environment that we usually don't get in medical schools. So what I want to tell you about is, uh, is work that really began here at Duke but primarily uh, is work that's been done at Stanford. And actually science here in the, in the minds of young students is you know like a lifelong dream. So you can see they're, they're really important for not only sensing our environment, but they're also important for communicating between different areas of the body. This lecture was giving motivation uh, or inspiration to not only to the students, but also established scientists like me. So I got interested in this family of receptors because uh, they were particularly important for drugs that we were using in the intensive care unit when I was uh, a medical resident. I didn't know he uh, is a medical doctor. So I was impressed that medical doctors can apply the basic science to the clinical field. What happened is I really never finished my cardiology fellowship because I just couldn't, I couldn't stop the research. I really loved what I was doing. Today, uh, many students are very impressed uh, with uh, his lecture, and I hope his lecture is encouraged them to be uh, researchers. So, it is great pleasure, and it was very important to me, Grace Andes. I don't really think I ever thought of giving up. I always thought that there was a solution. So, no matter when a, an experiment failed, I always could think of something else to try. I learned that I should assume that every experiment is going to fail and build in troubleshooting into that experiment. Uh, and that, uh, I think, is a message that the young scientists need to hear. If you keep on working hard, uh, if you learn from your mistakes, and if you have uh, a collaborative mind, you can accomplish just about anything. I think it's really important to, you know, to recognize the biggest talent you have is your young people. They'll, they'll have the greatest ideas and their most energy. 